morning to you! Welcome back, everybody! I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to some nauseous... We're doing what today? I don't know. I always just kind of like get into these episodes and I'm like, wait, what am I actually doing? Oh, yeah. Um, something I learned, or maybe potentially learned, was that I can do this. And then you get a fuck ton of seeds out of it. I can grow so many of them now! Oh, it all makes Seeks sense! Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to. I'm trying to make my water system! Welcome aboard, Captain. Do you have a place for me to get diamonds to make... What was it? What was I... What was I putting into this? Aerogel? Huh? Didn't I mark Aerogel? I did! Gel sack and a ruby, actually. Not a diamond. Why did I need that? Oh, the upgrade. The depth module upgrade. That was it. Haha. -ha. Thank you for leaving a comment, which I won't read until the episode's up. Appreciate that. Um, I need to make that. And also, I need to go back to that base then. The Omega base. Where was it? And I need to knife those plants to be able to get seeds for it for my grow bed. I forgot that that's what I had to do to actually get the seeds out of them to be able to plant them. All I did was replant them. I couldn't even do that, actually. I tried to, and then it didn't work. So all I did was replant ribbon plants. I'm very good at video games. The best, even. A savant. Am I just keeping the conversation going until I can do this? Yes. Could I edit it out? Also, yes, but I don't want to. I have to sit here and farm this stuff for a million years. So you guys are gonna have to sit here and do it with- So, depth module upgrade. Was that up or down? Aquarium module? No. I wanna pin that as well. Because I have the plasteel ingot. I just need to get some damn diamonds! You think you're better than me, diamonds? You think you're too good for my inventory? Oh, I'll find you. Usually- Well, see, I'm operating off old Subnautica. Saying like, oh, they're around the island. But they might not be. I think I read that they're- down in the deep twisty bridges. Not to be confused with the deep twisty britches, which is what happens when my pants get tangled. Way up inside my asshole. Should probably be a little careful, huh? My, uh, sea truck only has 52 integrity because Captain Dum Dum of the SS Numbnuts forgot to build a repair tool. That's me, in case you couldn't keep up. Um, you might be Captain Dum Dums as well. <laughs> um, I also remember there being something over this ridge. God, he's gonna grab me, isn't he? I don't want him to. I don't consent to that. Wait, are you gel sex? Warning, passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. I don't think you're a gel sack. I think he's just a pain in my ass. Whoa! He just killed him! More like the Great Barrier Sheesh! I don't have any power in this thing. That would very much help, actually. Um, forgetting my buttons, panicking slightly. Panicking, panicking, we're panicking. Woo! -wee! Let's head to the Omega Base now! Maybe we'll find diamonds over there. Woo! No, 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 no! Geothermal activity detected below. <gasps> Beware of high pressure and temperature. Uh, that geothermal activity was me shitting my pants! Deep, deep below! Holy god, yeah, piss off now, thanks. I don't know why he's leaving. If anything, it's like when you're trying to like crack open a nut to get the sweet, juicy innards. I basically just opened the nut myself for him. And came out, and then he was like, well, I really just like the thrill of the chase more than anything. Uh, diamond, diamond. Di dim diamond. Warning, no. passing 200 meters. Oxygen Whatever. efficiency greatly decreased. Oh yeah, I got a blueprint for a rebreather. I forgot. Silicone fiber mesh and a wiring kit. I could make that already. Oh man. Why am I down here? I'm gonna die, actually. What? What? Uh, quartz. Why does quartz look like diamonds? Who 
did that? Who designed it that way? Huh? I'm not gonna choose some Nautica devs. Who did it? Somebody came in and put both of them and we're like, haha, this is gonna fool them. Please don't. Please don't. Please, please don't. Please don't. Beautiful seeds. I'm gonna have one grow bed of them. Yes. Yes. What were you good for? Nothing. You're good for nothing. Um, is that enough? Yeah, that's plenty. That's plenty loads. Let me just drink the air. Oh yeah. It tastes so good in the deep down, dark deep down. Diamond? Diamond anywhere? Diamond? Anybody get diamond? What the fuck is this? Ah! Fucking titanium deposits. I can't really grab them sometimes. Why are you guys just chilling out there? Weird. Um, okay, cool. Oh, that's my beacon. Now I can go back to my base and make a rebreather and also plant these seeds. Then we should be able to go much deeper. Well, not much deeper, but stay deep for longer. Now, how do I get back without dying? I forgot, by the way, the last time you guys saw me, I was stuck. <laughs> I was stuck in the ground. Yeah, I got out. There's a, a console command you can do that just warps you forward however many meters you want. So I just warped myself forward one meter, and then suddenly I was out. So I solved the problem with uh, science. <laughs> it's a very easy solution, actually. Oh, whoa. Where am I? Wait, is this the mining site? Whoa! This is not at all where I thought I was. Oh. Hold on, let's do a little exploring for a sec. This is where we go in with the prawn suit to get some stuff. Or at least I did go in with the prawn suit. To get some stuff in the past. Anything here? Oh, God. We need a rebreather in here. This place is cool, though. There's some cool lore to this area. Ruby! Oh, big worth! And a moon pool! Oh, hyper big worth. Did I get that? Yeah. Nice! And a diamond! Woo! I'm so glad I came in here! Is that another one? Woo! Diamond! Fuck yeah! This place is Pog Champ! <laughs> we got so many things! These are all the things I needed. More diamonds, holy hell! You any more rubies? Oh, I can finish my water filtration system soon, I think. Yes! Epic! <laughs> I didn't know these were in here. I could have just gone right past and not come in here at all. Oh yeah, oh that's deep down dark. Deep down dark, deep down for sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't want to be in there. No, -uh. not yet. Diamond! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I know, but look at all these diamonds. <laughs> I'm gonna build me a diamond spaceship to get off this godforsaken dump. Oh, and maybe find out about what happened to my sister. Maybe. Please no, please no. I have a family. Shh, he doesn't know that my sister's dead. Oh, shitty, shitty. Oh, shitty. Oh, shitty. Oh, shitty! Yahoo! Where do I go? What do I do? Where do I- There's fucking three of them! Ah! <laughs> Just fucking go. Just go and hope that the graces of the good heavens are with you. Just go! Go! Ah! Let's look for gel sacks on our way back. Gel sack? Anybody? Gel sack? Aren't gel sacks attached to these bridges? Am I misremembering? Ah! Uh, 
Uh-oh. 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 I can see your shadow. I can see you chasing me. I love this soundtrack. Well, the entire soundtrack's good, but I really, really like this song. Uh... Makes me feel like my friends are all here singing in choir tandem. Wow! Are these fully grown? Dude! That's insane! Okay! <laughs> I have a million ribbon plants. That's that's too much. Honestly. Hell yeah. And now I can actually eat this. Mm. Do we actually have any glass? No. I do have quartz though. That doesn't make me enough glass. God damn it. The amount of quartz I saw that wasn't diamonds and now I need it. Just end this suffering! End this abysmal existence! This music... Oh, fills me with the goodies. Oh, it's like a big warm hug. I love it so much. Makes me want to cry. It's so familiar. Play it again. No, don't stop. Alright, and I should have... Plasteel ingot. Yeah! 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 Let's go! Depth module upgrade, baby! What's that, 300 meters then? Where are you, Tonto? Where does this go in? Here? Wow! 300 meters, baby! <laughs> That's a pog champ! Nice, 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 nice. Um, so what else do I need? Um, well, I can unpin this bad bitch. Bye! Silicone rubber and crystalline sulfur. I had one of those, and I had one of those. I don't have a repair tool, do I? That I just haven't equipped. I'm glad that the rare repair tool doesn't need, like, um, a resource. Like, you don't need to put anything into it other than a battery to make stuff go. Um, put a battery into you, put a battery into you. Because, like, you're repairing your whole ship with it, but you don't need anything other than power. I guess it's just like a welder or something, right? But it doesn't have, like, a, a resource that you need to use up. Like, titanium or something. Make a silicone rubber, and that is our rebreather done. Booyah! The rebreather fa- Uh-huh. Facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Breathe the freedom. Breathe the freedom, yeah, yeah. Can we have more dirty bean water? Can you say that line again? Actually. It should be still in here, right? I don't know where it was. There it is! Ah, the sweet scent of dirty bean water. That's me right now, drinking good old dirty bean water from Jacksepticeye's top of the morning coffee. Please, just go buy my coffee. That's, that's the whole point of this bit right now. <laughs> you know, everybody has to like dance around what they want to say. Just, just go buy it. That's it. I'm not lying to you. I'm not fluffing it up. Just do it. God damn. All right. I need a gel sack. If I get a gel sack, then I make my water filtration system. And then that is very, very nice. What the hell do they look like? Probably a lot like their picture on the right hand side. Sorry, sorry, I'm just destroying a whole fucking ecological environment by doing this. Sorry. My god, I can barely even go down deep enough in this thing. Even with the upgrade. Maximum what is that?! I don't need you talking to me, I need, I need- Oh, gel sacks! Gel sacks! Gel sacks! They're over there! They're over there! They're over there! Okay, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. 
mother of... Oh. What? Something like belched at me under the water. Blech. Wanted to eat my entire ass. Thank you. I only needed the one gel sack, actually. Storage module fragment. Nice. And a battery. Batteries are nice. Oh, why sounds? <laughs> this game makes me want to vomit. Out of sheer terror. Storage module? Fabricator module. So many modules. Oh, it's you! Captain Hentai Lips! Dirty bastard! Ooh, so many diamond. Frick yeah! Whoa! God, it took me ages to find them before, and now I have a veritable smorgasbord. Did I say that word? Smorgasbord. Is that Swedish? Robin. <laughs> Can you, is that Swedish? Any oh. Anything you put up on screen will be helpful. Smorgasbord. <laughs> oh my god. It's like fucking sweat under a titty. That's how many times there are. <laughs> Is that really where my brain went for that analogy? <laughs> they were just like nestled under there, you know. Titty sweat. I have determined the location oh. of some important technology. Oh? I implore you to investigate. Will this help us build your body? <laughs> I do not know what we will find. I just know it is important. Signal what? location uploaded to PDA. Okay, Alan? I'll trust you for now only because you're the only alien I've ever met. But if you fuck me over, it's gonna... It's gonna mess up my interpretation of all aliens from here on out. You're a representative for all alien species. Okay, that's cool though that his uh, marker is one of the, like, precursor architect sort of symbols. Epic. All right, I didn't get the... I still need to get the fabricator modules for the sea truck and also the docking module. I don't think I've gotten the full bits of that yet, either. Um, but I do have the storage one, I started on the aquarium one, and I think I have the sleeper module as well. That's too many. So why do you need... why do you need that? It's, it's a fucking... it's a truck, why do you need that? Uh... Hi-ho! Hi-ho! It's off to work I go! Making aerogel for my filtration system. Hi ho! Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho! Uh, where's my thingy? There it is. Boom! Baby! How do I. What? How do I do? Do I make a bottle? I. How does this work? <laughs> Hello? Could I put you in the thermos? I don't know how this thing works. Water filtration system. Filtration system draws water unfit for human consumption into external source, automatically spits it into a constituent part. While dispensing of any harmful byproduct, the alter water filtration any liquid and pure refreshing HP possible. Okay. Does it just does it just end up here when it's done? I can't remember. This whole series is me saying I can't remember. How's my little fellas doing? Good? Yes. Yes. Very good, yes. Proliferate! Become one with nature for my amusement! I don't know what I'm saying. I'm trying to say like evil things. It's not really working out. <laughs> Fuck yeah! My little plant children! They're gonna be really handy. They're one of my most valuable resources right now. Because they heal me. They feed me. And they water me. Not as much on the waterfront, but that's fine. You can't have all three. Oh, there it goes. Progress. 18% water, 36% salt. It's like most people online. So while that's doing that, let's go over and see what Alan has found. Oh, over here in the great beyond. Architect artifact. Architect artifact. Art <laughs> that's a tongue twisty. Talk about the deep twisty bridges. Try saying that three times fast. Architect artifact. Architect artifact. That's a hard one. Golly gee, sir! <laughs> Non-English speakers be like... Or non-native English speakers be like... What? 
Trust me, even I'm like that. Whoa, where are we? I thought this was over towards where the island was. This is new. What you got? You got goods? Fucking flares. Nutrient block, nom nom. Oh, we had that already. Well... What a bunch of stink. What you got? You got goods? You got goodies? Water? We'll take. Thank you. What are these little... Oh, these are like... They're like arrows pointing you which way to go. <laughs> Fuck you. Dick. It's like pointing that way. Should I go that way? Nah. 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 Where's my... Oh. <laughs> I'd, I'd lose me head if it wasn't attached. <laughs> oh, this is like the deep kelp area, right? Oh, what are you doing? It's just exploded me already. Whoa, these are lots of fragments of like a propulsion cannon. Whoa! Wait, all of that counted as one? A sea monkey nest. Oh, because they steal all your stuff and bring it back. That's kind of cool. Oh, I hate this area, though. This is very confusing to know where I am. What, like a million fragments in that thing? Why did I scan and only get one? This is a scam. Scam Nautica. Is this where you're bringing all your shit back? Oh my fucking way. Laser cutter fragment. Ooh, baby. Yes, sir. Um, let me unpin this. Ah, no, 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 no. Did you? Was that mine? Come here, you bitch. Come here. Ah! Yeah, fuck you. Murdered you. You're dead now. How does that feel? Bet it doesn't feel pretty good, huh? Where's the thing you stole? Doesn't matter. I stole your life. We're fair. We're even. Square. Squared away. Laser cutter fragment. Yes. Yes. Should I steal their children? No, the last thing I need is more of those fuckers going around. I don't even think I'm supposed to be in here. Oh, hold on. Pause champ. I'm ex actually, exactly supposed to be in here. What you found is more than just an artifact. It will help me follow the traces my people left on this planet. A water analysis station. This apparent research device seems built to determine the chemical components and properties of water samples. Possible applications, testing for levels of Kara bacterium in the water, spectroscopic analysis, experimental application of light, heat, or chemical compounds via the cylindrical core at the center of the storage chamber. Yeah, for sure. I'm glad it could help. I know you would still prefer me to have a corporeal form of my own. Well, yes. If you continue searching, I may regain some of my connection to the network, piece by piece. How the hell did I get in here? How do I get out? Oh, thank God. I thought I, thought I was dead. Oh, I have a phone call from my head. How do your people communicate? If you are not networked. What do you mean? We just talk to each other. Do you not find that primitive? We exist as data. We are all aware of each other's thoughts and needs. Scientific endeavors are accomplished much more smoothly in this way. There's more to life than research, Alan. I can't lie. Work would go faster if I could read my colleagues' minds, but thoughts are private, and people have their own inner lives. People change and need space to think. Space helps you think. I find that being separated from my network is very quiet. What, what do you mean by quiet? Imagine a thousand strings, each playing its own range of notes, none louder than the others. Each one builds harmony, 
a continuous thrum in the background of existence. I am now a lone stream in search of familiar harmonies. No. I'll help you find them. That's so sad. It's also a really nice way of looking at it. Man, could you imagine if that's our future? If that's what evolution actually is? Like people talk about AI like destroying humanity and taking over and all that, but what if AI is so smart that Okay, we're gonna get deep for a second. Imagine if an AI becomes sentient and then it can like Google search for itself to improve itself. Like when you Google search something, it happens instantly. Or more or less instantly. So could you imagine an AI that's able to do that? and find the solutions to all the things at once, instantaneously, all at the same time, as soon as it becomes sentient. It's almost like a singularity, in a way, that everything just happens all at once. Boom! Big bang! And it's like, it's figuring stuff out, it, it knows what it needs to fix, it's building upon itself, it's like, oh, this thing isn't working? Okay, let me do a million billion computations all at once, figure out the solution, okay, that's fixed, and then it's doing that all the time, exponentially. So what if it's so smart and so over-the-top intelligent that it's able to be like, well, why would I destroy humans when I can easily figure out the way of merging a human's brain with this machine? Which, some would argue, is destroying humans. But... That's what I'd like to think. That's the... That's the optimistic side of me. <laughs> like, that that's what I think uh, evolution will be. That's what I think will happen with machines. I don't think they'll destroy us. I think they'll figure out a way of working with us to help us. And then we all coexist. Wouldn't that be cool? I think so. Um, alrighty, cool. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Oh, perfect timing. Take the salt out. Unpowered. Oh man, god damn it. Wait, was this a thing where like one solar panel yields 70 power? Was it a thing where I could add more solar panels to get more power? Or should I just increase? Should I just go for like a bio power system? Because now I have plants that I can just shove them all in and create a bio system. Maybe I should do that actually instead. Yeah, let's create a second room. Damn, I need more titanium. I need a lot more titanium. We'll create a... connector. Yeah, make it... No, not a glass one, because I need stuff for that. Why can't that go there? Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. And then we'll create another multi-purpose room off that. Okay, titanium search incoming. Eh? Voila! Noish. 575. Okay. I'm hoping that ribbon plants can power this. Because ribbon plants are the things that I get the most amount of seeds back out of. Let me see. Because hitting the other plants, I get two seeds out of them. Hitting a ribbon plant, I get what? Like four to six? Something like that. Yes. Yes. It says it's active. That's... That's good, right? Yeah, power's going up. <laughs> nice! Hell yeah! Okay, let's fill this bad boy up. Let me get all of my ribbon plants. Oh wait, I'm on the wrong side. Oh wait, no, I wasn't. I was on the right side. <laughs> Let me make sure that I have enough for this. Yeah, I get so many. It's like three or four plants gets the entire bed. So many. That's epic. 
Because the other thing was that I needed to get batteries all the time. Fuck yeah! So that was what, four plants did the entire bed? That's huge! That's huge. And I have some left over. Dude! Epic poggers. Oh, I had some here as well. Nice! I'm a force to be reckoned with now, baby! So that's gonna mulch that all up. Look at them all go. Oh, lovely, beautiful power. Oh, you can hear the rain. So cozy. Um, that's great. So now my water filtration system will just be going on its own all the time. I have a source of... Basically infinite food. Not... Not really. <laughs> this one's... Like, it's fine. It's just... Oh, wait, could I just... Oh my god, did they just regrow when I do that? Is that what happens, or do I actually have to take them out? <gasps> oh, I've been doing it super inefficiently. Oh, you can actually take the fruit out of them. Oh, wait, whoops. Wait, I... Do they regrow? Or should I just be doing this? Because I could just keep the, the thing full then, right? Eh. Um. Like that. Let me, let me leave like a row of them to see. Because I'm unsure. I don't know if they like repopulate like that. Or if I have to chop them up and put more stuff in. Well, now I just have a bunch of these. <laughs> I fucked it up. So what's next for me then? Can I go to that mining site? No, I need a prawn suit for that. I need to get more bays for this. But I think the ones that I really want, I don't have schematics for yet. Sea truck docking module, storage module, sleeper, aqua aquarium module I don't really care about. Fabricator module, docking module, and storage module are like the main ones. Because then I can kind of like make stuff as I go. So these two I have. Computer chip, plasti lingot, and lead. Okay. I guess I can work on those. First things first, we need to make a countertop. Let's go right here. Much nicer. Young cotton anemone? Where the hell would I get that? I'm low on titanium, actually. Usually you'd have a million titanium, but this looks better now. Oh, it even has reflections. Nice. I've had a very productive piece of farming. I think I have all the components I need. Uh, do I have enough lithium? Actually, yeah, there's a piece of lithium here. Is it just one or two? It's two. I might not have enough. I have enough. Never mind. <laughs> Everything's great. Need two plasteel ingots. Um. I have a wiring kit made. Now I make a computer chip. Nice. Or did I put the wiring kit? Here. So. Wait, was that everything? Let me see, I guess. Uh, fabricator module and sea truck storage module. Wait, did they not work without the docking module? Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Never mind that, I'm seeking upgrades. Well, at least these will be built and here. No, no, the hazardous conditions, whatever am I gonna do? Nice. Uh, 
I think that's what the docking module is for, is to put these ones on, right? I don't think I can just connect them. No. Damn it. <laughs> or was it this way? Oh! It was that way. Never mind. Wait, what happened to the reverse camera that you used to be able to get? Hello? Oh, I missed it. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. Nice. Wait, so what's the docking module for? I really can't remember. Now we have a fabricator and we have a bunch of storage. Those are two very vital ingredients for this thing, because when I'm out and about and I'm doing... It's basically like the sea moth and the cyclops mixed together. Cyclops was like your mobile base, and then your sea moth was your nimble little thing that you could fly around in, and now this is both of those. Um, should I put anything in storage? It's always good to have some titanium with you. Some bits and bobs for... Just crafting on the go. See if there's anything in here that I should bring. Um, maybe a ribbon plant? If I need to make batteries on the go. Okay, so they don't regrow. So you actually have to destroy them. That makes a lot of sense, honestly. And put you sweet babies back in. Do need some though. Or did I? No, I didn't. <laughs> Now I have too many of them. God damn it. Can you put the seeds in as fuel? Because then we're really cooking. <laughs> if those can get burnt as fuel. I'm just, I just have way too much power. Really. I can't be stopped. I could actually make two water filtration systems if I want. Have both of them going at the same time. What was it I needed to build the, that? Oh, aerogel, yeah. Well, no, nah, never mind. Never mind. That's a pain in my ass. <laughs> but fuck you! We did it anyway! Woo! Two filtration systems! Let's go! <laughs> it's mainly because I can. I'm just showing off at this point. Oh, maybe we should build that uh, tech room. Uh, what was it? This one. Control room. Advanced wiring kit, glass, and titanium. Oh, I just ran out of my titanium. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, maybe I can still make it, actually. Okay, control room. Nice. In the control room, you can change base lighting and colors, rename your base, and see information about power and structural integrity but not the integrity of societal power structures. <laughs> okay, calm down. Whoa, cool. Structural integrity, four. I, okay. Power status, 86%. It's like going up and down. Oh wait, no it's not. Okay, so I've met the two filtration systems going at all times are not enough for the power in my base. So I either need more power or I need to get rid of one of those. Might just get rid of one of them because I think that was overkill anyway. Um, customize appearance. So the base can be... Black. With white stripes. And then the name can be, uh, Gigabase. I don't know. I just want to see what it looks like. So this stuff I can't, like, click on. It's, oh, you get the time of day and everything. Okay. Wow. You, so you can make, like, a massive base. If it's allowing you to go around. Ah, oh, and the foundation has zero power draw. Has two structural integrity. 
And then the multi-purpose rooms add minus 125. So that has... Oh, you can actually disable sections. Holy crap. Wow, this is all new. I've never used this in the game before. That's awesome. Um, oh yeah, these are getting used up. Hell yeah, that's cool. So we're hovering around 498, 497 power. It's not really going up or down. Oh, it's slightly going up. Hmm. Interesting. That's a, a really neat addition to the whole thing. Um, I might add some structural plating. Just, oh. Do I have to take down the picture? I guess we could add them here, right? Oh, I, I don't have lithium. Uh, there we go. Nice! So that adds 7 to your base. So now I'm at 10.5, so that's good. Um... Is this... Yellow because it's showing this room? I'm not quite sure. I want to go outside and see what the base looks like now. Now that I've used... Or now that I've changed the colors of it. Whoa! That's awesome! Dude, you could never change the color of your base before- Oh, well, in before people tell me that you actually could the entire time and I just didn't know how to do it. I've never changed my base color before. This looks sick! Ooh, maybe it should have yellow stripes on it. And then the name can be in yellow as well. Oh, yeah. It kind of looks green. There's like a greenish tint in it. Maybe I put it more on the green side of things, or maybe it's just the way... I mean, the water is blue, so maybe it's mixing with that. <laughs> that looks sick, though! God damn! Can't wait to see what else I can do. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave this episode here then. We made some decent progress again, especially towards the base front. Now that some of my more... basic sort of needs are met, now that I have, like... I have, like, proper shelter, I have, um, power going, I have a, as much water as I'm gonna need, as much food as I'm gonna need, and as much power as I'm gonna need. And also, I've gone to a few of the places that are around, went to that base and got some stuff there, and made some sea truck modules and all that kind of stuff. Now that all of this is sort of in place, now real exploration can begin. Um, what did I need for Mark II modules? Enamel glass, sea truck... Oh, synthetic fibers. I don't know what those are. I don't think I can make those yet. Ruby and spiral plant clipping. Yeah, I don't know. So, next time, what I want to focus on... I need to write this down because I'll forget. I, I want to focus on getting a laser cutter. And then we can go to that big ship. And then we can blast that open and get around in there. And hopefully get some materials out of that. Or... I don't know if that'll give me anything that's going to progress me, or if it's just going to give me materials that I need, or if it's like repulsion cannons and that kind of stuff. But I think I need to go back down into that kelp base to the sea monkey nests and get laser cutter fragments out of those, or find them somewhere else. I'm sure there's plenty of places I can find them, but really happy with how things are progressing. I'm not trying to progress things too quickly, like the story. Um, that stuff will come in time, and then it'll all start like happening really quickly. So I'm just glad that some of this more basic stuff is in place, and I can fill out my base a bit more in here as well, and add more doors and that kind of stuff, so... Yeah! Really cool! I'm really happy with it. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode! Don't forget to leave a like on the video if you enjoyed watching it! Uh, it really helps the series kind of get pushed out to more people as well, um, so more people can get in on the Subnautica train and see what it's all about and why everyone's obsessed with it. But also, don't forget to subscribe! Um, to keep up to date if you're new here for all the episodes coming out in the future, because they might... I don't think they're going to be every day, so to just keep up to date and have notifications and all that stuff on, so you can find them whenever they come out. But thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Oxygen.